Uh, let's get into one logic. Here's a stock yeah. that hasn't come up. And Ian Lawrence, nice little <coughs> company. Last time I checked, it, the, the price had been doing well. Yes, because the company underlying the price has been doing well. <laughs> so, uh, always useful. Yes. <laughs> uh, they're buying back some shares now, um, these Ingwe shares, and um, they're principally in the movement of motor vehicles to um, uh, the, the retailers. And uh, there's a strike there at the moment, but it's a South African strike with the unions. Well, they're more into Africa, taking vehicles into Africa and those uh, car sales there, and locally, but also more non-unionized than some of the other guys. So that's the good news. Um, I think some of the bad news is we've had an eight or nine week strike in the vehicle uh, chain, all the way from the components to the actual manufacturers. So that has had a knock-on effect where there were less new cars being completed and therefore needed, uh, that needed to be transported mm -hmm. to the ultimate dealers. So that will impact them to some extent. But they've made a few acquisitions over the last year or two. Some of those will annualize. They went in for the full year previously. Uh, good little uh, companies that they bought at decent prices, very cash generative. So I still like the company, even though in the short term there might be a little bit of a blip. They went some great acquisitions, but the Atlas Panel Beaches, yeah. I, I get it. I don't get it. <laughs> Your take on One Logics? We, we like it. Um, as John P said, the special vehicle delivery services and vehicle delivery services are pretty mature assets. Uh, and they throw a lot of cash. They, they're busy reinvesting that into other companies. I think a Zambian transport company and a via, uh, vehicle behavior mm -hmm. company. So, so we like management. We, uh, it's a quality company. And uh, yeah, as there might be some short-term headwinds, but uh, in the long term, we like it.